Southampton kick off against Wolves in the three o'clock kick off today. Wolves won the reverse fixture of this at Molyneux in September when they beat uh, Southampton 2 0. If you're looking at it overall, I think realistically Southampton probably come into this game in the best of form. They're on 33 points now with six, game re- six games remaining. They had 36 points uh, across the course of last season, so they're well on course to, to outdo last season because of the form that they're in. If you're looking at, at Wolves, They've lost actually more times against teams in the bottom six at the start of play than in team against teams in the top six. They've lost six games against teams in the bottom six and five in the in the top six. So the record against the top six this season's been been quite good. Southampton are five points above relegation, um, five points above Cardiff. So they are in a in a very very strong position right now. They've actually scored in each of the last eleven home games as well. As for, for Wolves, no wins in the last five away in all competitions. They've lost the last two away from home as well. Something, again, that uh, that goes against them. They've conceded in each of the last 12 away games as well, Wolves. So, Wolves to concede in this game is, is certainly something you'd be looking at here. If you're looking at the goals as well, Raul Jimenez, he scored five in his last eight, 16 goals for him this season. Just agreed a permanent move to Wolves. He's been in excellent form. No real standout play for Southampton. Shane Long did score uh, last time out in the 3-1 defeat against uh, Liverpool at home. He's looking to score back-to-back goals in uh, in nearly three years, so you'd be maybe looking out for that one if you fancy Shane Long to score at any time. I fancy Southampton to win this, given Wolves' away record. Southampton to win to nil in this. I don't uh, I don't see it being an open game. Southampton to win at an under 2.5 goals as well. I don't see there being a glut of goals in this game, but I fancy Southampton just to get the job done.